Hi there. Thanks for following on this doula adventure. Um, so to follow up from yesterday um, about how to choose a doula, here's two questions that uh, many women I talk with don't think about asking. And I haven't seen them on any fancy dancy websites or pregnancy apps. Um, and please don't be uncomfortable or shy about asking these questions. They're valuable um, if you think they are. They're valuable. Um, they can show you a lot about who you're talking to and how they see their role as a doula um, and what kind of person they are as far as their, the personality that they bring to your birth team. Two questions are, um, how many clients do you take on a month and what kind of involvement do you have in the community? Um, how many clients? The answer will range between um, one doula taking on two to three clients um, another doula taking on six to eight clients within a four-week calendar month. Um, some doulas work in pairs or small teams. Um, and so get to know the answers to those questions, to that question, um, and be comfortable with it. If you don't like her answer, move on to the next one. Um, the second question I mentioned about uh, community involvement, ask your doula potentials, um, what kind of activities they do in and around your local community. Um, do they attend mother and baby events, um, small mother circles or big large events? Um, do they um, network or uh, network with other professionals um, who could provide other services to you um, and your family in need? So that will give you a sense of how your doula sees her role in the greater community in your area. Um, and also the first question about how many clients your doula takes on in a month, that'll show you, you know, also um, what her perspective is on, um, you know, that can lead into some interesting conversations. So don't be afraid to ask, get nosy. It's, uh, it's okay. She's going to see a lot more of you if you choose to hire her and whoever you choose to include on your birth team is going to be um, seeing a whole lot more of you. So um, make sure it's somebody you're comfortable with and uh, subscribe and follow up on um, you know other social media outlets and um, keep in touch. See you soon.